Despite a new lawsuit recently filed against him, Alec Baldwin appeared to be in good spirits at the Roundabout Theatre Company's 2023 gala. The 64-year-old actor hit the red carpet solo at the annual bash, held at the Siegfeld Ballroom in New York City on Monday evening. The outing comes just days after three more Rust crew members filed a lawsuit against the actor, claiming they now suffer from anxiety and PTSD after the tragic death of cinematographer Helena Hutchins on the set of the Western movie Rust. Baldwin stepped out with a classic black suit with a blue-gray dress shirt and a dark tie under a black suit coat with a purple pocket square. The actor seemed to be sporting the early makings of a new beard as he hit the red carpet on Monday night. The embattled actor completed his look with matching black pants and black dress shoes for the annual event. While Baldwin pleaded not guilty to involuntary manslaughter in late February, just days later three Rust crew members filed a lawsuit against the actor. The filing alleges that the crew members have experienced anxiety and post-traumatic stress disorder PTSD, after the shooting death of cinematographer Helena Hutchins on the Rust set on the Bonanza Creek Ranch near Santa Fe, New Mexico. The crew members, Dolly operator Ross Adiego, set costumer Doran Curtin and key grip Reese Price, also claim they were near the gun when it was fired and have since suffered, blast injuries from the gun going off unexpectedly. Hutchins fell to the ground in front of Curtin. She watched in shock as Hutchins grabbed at her abdomen, the lawsuit states. Plaintiff Curtin put her hands on Hutchins' stomach, trying to find the source of Hutchins' pain and figure out what was going on. As the chaos continued, Plaintiff Curtin was ushered out of the church. Once outside, she collapsed from the effects of the blast and the shock of the shooting. The lawsuit also accuses the producers of cutting corners and hiring individuals who had been the subject of previous safety complaints, including David Halls, the first assistant director, and armorer Hannah Gutierrez-Reed, who lacked experience because the producers allegedly wanted a quick and cheap production. Gutierrez-Reed, like Baldwin, is also facing a charge of involuntary manslaughter, which carries a maximum sentence of 18 months in prison, and she also pleaded not guilty. Also attending the Roundabout Theatre Company's 2023 gala was Sutton Foster, who hit the red carpet in a black coat with a plunging neckline she also accessorized with diamond earrings and a stunning green necklace that fell into her plunging neckline. The actress completed her look with several rings, black pants and black heels for the annual event. Baldwin's former 30 Rock co-star Jane Krakowski also attended the event with a leggy ensemble. The blonde actress stepped out with an oversized white dress shirt slightly tucked into a black miniskirt, completing her look with black pumps. The marvelous Mrs. Maisel star Rachel Brosnahan hit the red carpet in a white pantsuit. She rocked a white suit coat with a plunging neckline and a pair of matching white pants for the event. The actress completed her look with diamond-studded earrings and silver pumps. Now